Good friends, I hope this day finds you well. This is Jay Coop here with Good Goodies. I'm feeling extremely well at the moment. My energy is balanced. I feel very equanimous. Equanimous, my new favorite word, meaning to be centered and have no judgment of, oh, this is good, good, or, oh, that's bad. Just right in the center. You know, observing calmly and objectively. It's fantastic. My energy center is feeling aligned, very open. Now, what is this crazy talk? What is this energy center stuff? The flow of your energy through your body is like the most important thing that when it comes to your health. All right, and you might say, man, that sounds pretty pretty crazy, pretty supernatural stuff right there. What, are you all right? Like, what, what kind of stuff are you talking about, man? Supernatural is a great way to describe this type of stuff. Um, your body has vibrations and frequencies going through it. Like, yeah, we're solid in terms of solid liquid gas, but even still, we are not solid objects. In fact, nothing in the universe is truly solid. Everything's made up of atoms and molecules, right, as we know. But did you know that an atom, the relative size of the nucleus and the electrons, is that of a couple of marbles on the 50-yard line of a football stadium as the nucleus. The electrons, marbles in the parking lot. All right, everything is empty space. More than 99.9% .9 is nothingness. What's it filled by? Energy, vibration. So this is a very important part of life and the universe in general that's usually not talked about in science class. You didn't learn about this in seventh grade because number one, it's not really that well understood yet. Science is now coming around to, to learn about these types of things, and they're getting on it. They're definitely running experiments, and it's supernatural. Yeah, not in the sense that it's beyond nature, super, but supernatural in terms of this is like super duper natural. Like, it's the epitome of nature. It's really what it comes down to. And of course we all know if you eat well and you exercise, these are good things for your body. It's good, it helps it run better. But the next level to it is to focus on those energy centers. Like, I know from experience, I can feel energy running through my body. Not right now, because I'm doing a couple of things, you know, kind of multitasking. You shut all that off, pay attention. It's there, man. It's really awesome. And you can open that up. Sometimes energy is blocked, and it can't fl flow freely, and then you can get sick, like, a lot more easily. Uh, things like meditation, open that up, clear that out. Eating well keeps it flowing nicely. Yoga, wow, yeah. That's the good goodies. And, um, ah, kind of speechless right now, but... <laughs> Oh, there was this uh, article I read about some guy who was getting a skin graft, and they were like, you know, he got burned or whatever, pretty bad. And it's going to take two years for you to be able to start growing skin back. So they said, okay. And this dude that he knew was running some tests with um, 432 hertz music and sounds tuned to the 432 hertz which I'll explain in a second, but they basically played this, these frequencies, and, you know, over his wound a few times a day, and it healed in like a month. So the 432, real quick, um, you guys should look into this. 440 hertz is the note A, the musical note, an A. It's 440 hertz, that's the frequency of it in modern music. But, 
to tune that, and everything's tuned relatively to the A. There's, you know, A, B, C, D. The 440 being that one example of an A note. If you get that A to a 432 hertz, which is a little bit lower, if you go all the way down to like, I don't know, about 410 or so, then you're talking about an A flat, you know, or getting into a G. But if you just go down about 8 hertz into the 432, you have an A, and then have everything else tuned relatively to that A, if you know anything about music, you might have to look into this a little bit more, because I'm, uh, you know, a little short on time here. I don't want to take up too much of your afternoon, but... If things are tuned on that scale, now all of a sudden it resonates with the universe. Because like I said, everything's frequencies and vibrations. The Earth itself lets out a vibration, I believe it's about 8 hertz. And that is on the musical scale when you count the 432 for the A. It's on that continuum. And it just resonates with everything. Um, it's really good for you. Energy. Supernatural. Tap into your supernatural powers. It's good goodies. Have a fantastic day. Oh, come to the rail this evening in Richland for a night of comedy. Should be a great time. Got $5 tickets. Hit me up. Inbox me. Let me know what's good. Good goodies. Signing off. You guys, take care.